Do you remember the riddle of Sphinx in Greek mythology? Well, modern Americans would probably answer, babies walk on four legs, but adults only drive. But this is a tragic answer to a riddle of modern civilization. Driving cars prevents us from doing physical exercises required for our daily health, wastes gas, and pollutes air. So why don't we walk and bike instead of driving? There are many benefits from walking and biking. One of the benefits is energy efficiency. Cars are fueled primarily by fossil fuels, which is a limited resource, whereas when I'm walking or biking, I'm using energy uh, from the food that I eat, and that is current solar energy that's coming out of, from the sun each year and is constantly being renewed. Most of our vehicle fuel comes from overseas, and so this is money that we're spending and is leaving our local economy. It's leaving Michigan, leaving the U.S., uh, whereas money we spend on food, on bicycle maintenance, things like that, that's money that's going to local shops, local farmers, and it's, it's better for our local economy to keep that money here and everybody is now concerned about carbon dioxide emissions from automobiles. How big is the problem if you constantly drive? For an average automobile, uh, you typically get about 20 miles per gallon, and gallon of gasoline has about 20 pounds of CO2 that's emitted when it's burned. So for your average automobile, you're gonna save about one uh, pound of CO2 for each mile that you don't drive, whether you're walking or biking, whatever else you're doing. But these energy and environmental concerns may not be strong enough to persuade inactive Americans to get out of the car and walk and bike. But the more inactive we are, the more we should be concerned about our own health. The health benefits of walking and biking are reduced risk for cardiovascular disease, stroke, certain types of cancer, and type 2 diabetes. It also builds muscle and physical fitness and helps us to maintain healthy weight or promote weight loss. And from a mental health perspective, it reduces our symptoms of depression and anxiety. For substantial health benefits, adults need at least 150 minutes of moderate physical activity every week or at least 75 minutes of vigorous activity a week or a combination of both. Biking and walking provides great uh, moderate or vigorous activity to meet those guidelines. Washtenaw Biking and Walking Coalition, which is known as WBWC, is a nonprofit organization formed by volunteer citizens. It has served to promote biking and walking activities in this community for a decade. The purpose of WBWC is um, that we're dedicated to improving facilities, developing strong policies, and building community support for bicycling and walking in Washtenaw County. Last October, WBWC held a pedestrian forum with the city staff and other community leaders. The outcome of this forum is expected to result in increased public awareness and strong law enforcement regarding pedestrians and bicyclists with possible local code amendments for them. And then on our education side, we have put together bike skills clinics in the past, and we're happy to go into organizations um, and put, put on a, um, a bike commuting skills workshop or maintenance workshop. We're organizing Bike Fest, which is held in conjunction with the Green Fair. Walking and biking are obviously beneficial to the environment and your health. Also, they make you feel better. Especially walking and biking in the community in Ann Arbor, we get to be outdoors, we get to see our neighbors or even people we don't know say hello. We get to smell the seasons and see the birds and just have more exposure to nature in general. So do you still want to keep driving? If you do, you should at least appreciate what bikers and walkers are actually doing when you see them on the street. The drivers should know that the best thing is just to, to be happy when you see a bicyclist or um, in front of you. It's one less car that's there. Um, that means that your environment's being improved and that that person is trying to get more engaged in the community. Mm -hmm.